Back to Detroit and right to work. The Tigers here getting a workout in before opening day on Friday. This team was competitive last year, showed a ton of promise, and they were consistently fun to watch. But as for all of that success in 2021, A.J. Hinch told me, leave it all in their rearview mirror. It doesn't feel like Florida, but how thrilled are you to be here? <laughs> no, it feels great. I mean, obviously, we, we left yesterday uh, pretty excited to get on the plane and get here. It doesn't matter whether it's sunny, whether it's cold, whether it's snowing, whether it's raining, we're happy to be here. A shortened spring training did nothing to curtail excitement and anticipation for 2022. The rebuild is also in the rearview mirror. The Tigers finally started spending again this offseason. They added shortstop Javi Baez and opening day starter Eduardo Rodriguez on free agent deals. They traded for catcher Tucker Barnhart as well. The sky's the limit. I mean, last year they, they were uh, obviously some really great strides forward. I'm just hoping to be a small part and do whatever I can to help the team win. In the future? The future is now. The young pitchers made the jump in the last two seasons. For Spencer Torkelson, the former number one overall pick, He's in the opening day lineup. I think Torque is ready for this level on a, on a lot of levels. I think he's ready emotionally. I think he's ready physically. Um, he doesn't have to carry us. He just has to be really good. I think I'm hitting him down in the order for a reason. It's just to get his feet wet, and then he'll quickly move his way up. Riley Green was supposed to join him, but a fractured foot will keep him out at least six weeks. In need of an outfielder, Alavila acquired Austin Meadows in a trade four days before the opener. Tigers planned for him, top half of the lineup, and an everyday player. I'm here just to, you know, be a good, be a, you know, good person, good teammate, and also, you know, attribute to this team as much as I can. AJ Hinch was asked if he wants his team and believes if this team can take a collective step forward. That's a storyline he said that's built outside this dugout. This team, though, he believes can beat anybody, and he truly believes they can be competitive each and every game. At Comerica Park with the Tigers, Brad Galley, Seven Action Sports.